the position drills today, or did you do anything else? Oh, no, I, I finished everything. I did everything today. How'd you do? I did well. I did pretty well. I mean, I don't know <laughs> the correct times or the, the exact times, but from what the scouts told me, I think I did pretty well on my, uh, my L drill and my uh, shuttle drill, so I, I did pretty good in those. Yeah. Was it better than what you did at the combine? Well, I didn't do anything in the combine. I do got my hyperextension in my knee. So uh, I was able to you know, treat that up, get healthy, and come back and do it here. And uh, I felt like I did pretty, pretty well. Um, could have been a lot better. Of course, you know, you've always had better numbers. But I feel like you know, I put numbers on the board, and they were pretty decent numbers. Is your knee fully healthy now? Uh, my knee's fully healthy now. You know, I, I'm wearing a little knee sleeve right now just for, uh, you know, this is a uh, precaution. You know, but my knee's fully healed. You know, I was able to do all the position drills, fluid motion, uh, fluid bend. Everything was perfectly fine on my knee. How is the mood for all of y'all today? The mood, um, you know what, well, me, me, me and Josh Carey were going to the combine. I, I can tell we were more, looking more relaxed. We weren't as, you know, you know, worried or stressed out. But I know some of my fellow teammates, you know, it's like this is, it's an anxious time, you know, it's a nervous time. You know, this is like, you know, the one opportunity to show stuff I'm capable of doing. So I know I kind of sense, you know, a little bit of you know, nervous, you know, a little, little shy in the beginning. But, you know, once everybody got their groove, they, everybody had a pretty good day. So. Looks like your best position is probably inside. Is that kind of what you've heard? Uh, so far, that's the high. I mean, I, I've know I've always been hearing things. People say you know, I'm, I'm too I'm too small to go outside, you know. But you know I'm I'm not big enough to go inside, you know. Which I think is ridiculous, you know. I'm fast enough to play outside, you know. I'm strong enough to play inside, you know. But um, I think you know, they take they do technical they do the technical side of it. They want you know the arm length, you know. They think I'm, I'm a more ideal fit for inside. And you know I did all my drills out of three point stance today, and they said I look very very fluid. They loved it. So you know if I was to transition to guard, it would be no problem. Just you put out a lot of offensive linemen in the NFL. How much does that help you at all? Being able, I don't know how much you talk to any of those guys. Um, well, you know, two of them in the NFL right now are two of my closest friends, uh, Joey Hunt and uh, Hala Kulavati Vitae. You know, and um, it just it, it adds a lot of pressure. Now, it doesn't make you like you know, oh, you know, it's like wow, like you know. I think I can't remember the exact time. I think since 2012, 2013, we have offensive linemen drafted every single year. You know, and I'm like, wow. I mean, like, I'm not gonna be the one to mess up that. You know, that trend, that following. You know, I mean. They, people used to call us linebacker U because we always had you know, good linebackers in the NFL. But right now we have I think at least like six or seven offensive linemen in the NFL, you know, on teams, on active rosters, and they're doing very, very well. So it just puts a lot of pressure to know that I have to live up to their standards, live up to their expectations, and do well in, in the league as well. How much pride did you take away from the combine running the fastest 40 for your position? How much pride? Yeah. Oh, I, so I've been running my whole life. I, I, I knew it was going to run that time. I could, it could have been a lot faster, you know, so. Yeah, I always joke around and say, you know, if I ran a slow time, my family's gonna kick me out of the family, you know. So, um, I took it, it, was, it was a lot of pride, though. I mean, I know being a third fastest uh, time in combat history, you know, that that's that's amazing, you know. And just me being an accomplice those things, you know, it's just it was it was better, you know, pride for my family. You know, I'm, I, I, I was able to do this for us. You know, I, I, I'm not a, just big office line I can run to. So. Um, Doing that, but I really didn't pride myself on running. I, I really want to do well on the bench. You know, I was I was mad that I was second. You know, I got 34 reps. I really want to get you know 36, 37. You know, because that's what I really want to harp on. Because people always you know hear all things. Oh yeah, he's too small. Look at him. He's he's frail. He's not strong enough. I'm, I'm like I've been plenty strong. You know, it's never been a problem. If you think it's a strength problem, I have to show people. So that's why I wanted to get like 36, 37. And I was kind of mad that I got 34. I was really more upset about that than the 40. All your track background paid off for you, didn't it? Yeah, it really did. It really did. <laughs> it's in my blood, you know. That's what it is.